Hey everyone, this is Wake Angel 2001 coming at you with a pretty interesting set. It's a two pack that has Amy and Tails. So I guess you can call it the uh, Sonic's Companions uh, series. Um, yeah, it's uh, it's an opaque box with no window. It's just a box and it features Amy and Tails. Um, it's really weird to have packaging like this. There's no window, no nothing. And um, I've already opened the box, but like inside, the figures are... The figures are literally taped to this internal support with in these plastic sandwich baggies. What a weird way to package the figures, right? Especially when you consider that um, this set, like, like usually when you, you try to get these guys off the blister bubbles, they stay so solidly stuck on that you have to practically turn the, the things inside out to get it to work. Uh, it's just kind of weird that they're packaged this way. Um, so yeah, let's let's get them the rest of the way out of there. Like, I guess this is mostly a packaging review because these are the same figures that have always been. And I was right. These are exactly the same figures that have always been. Um, Amy has not been resized in any way. She's still four inches tall instead of properly four inch scaled. Uh, Tails is still perfectly scaled. But this is the original version that had the big giant tails behind him. Uh, not, the, not the newer molds with the smaller tails and the flight pose or anything like that. Um, but yeah, like... They are exactly the same. Tails comes with the little invincibility bubble. Amy comes with her hammer as always. Uh, same, uh, I see no paint defects, no flaws. It's not like these are more cheaply manufactured than the main singular releases. Amy still has her universal shoulders, ball jointed wrists, her head still turns. She still has those hips that go everywhere. She still has her universally jointed knees, ball jointed ankles, you know, everything is still Everything's still exactly the same as before. Same with tails, head swivel, universal shoulders, ball jointed wrists, no elbows, uh, hips, knees, ankles, tail, you know, everything's exactly the same. So, yep, just a straight up re-release of two figures that uh, people already have. Although I think the set retails for a bit of a lower price. Uh, this was sent to me by a by a fan, a commissioner. Um, don't. I don't remember how much they the 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 listing was for. Was it like fourteen bucks? If it was fourteen bucks, it's actually a bargain because uh, these figures normally retail for ten. So you're getting each figure for seven dollars. So if you somehow manage to miss either one of these or both of them, then this probably would be the cheapest option to get them at this point. Um, uh, except, you know, waiting for another re-release in the main line. But, yeah. Um, yeah, not much to say. Just a straight-up re-release. The most interesting thing about it was the packaging, because, you know, that's, that's weird. It's weird to be packaged in this thing. All right, thank you all for watching. This is Wake Angel 2001 signing off.